why I wrote it, it really is something where today in, in the sport business industry, there are, um, you know, you just see a lot of different things, a lot of ethical things, a lot, a lot of, of, of instances where I guess both as someone who is helping educate, our, our, you know, Loris College sport management students to be leaders in the industry and, and also a father of three, you just see a lot of different challenging situations. And so the book hopefully gets people to think through a lot of, a lot of things that we in society consider to be the norm um, and, and that we accept. And to really challenge that thought process, especially when it comes to the human dignity of others, whether it's in scenarios in athletics or whether it's uh, more on the business side of the sports. Um, and so that, that really is the driving force of what this book um, is about. You know, um, Developing Responsible Contributors really was written um, as, as a way to, to help educate uh, persons um, whether they're interested in sport or not, on just a lot of different uh, issues in the sport business industry, whether it's in the athletic arena itself or whether it's more on the business side of the house. Um, just issues uh, specifically as it pertains to human dignity, how, um, how people are, are depicted in, in the media, especially women or, th or folks through online blogs and some of the hateful diatribe, um, whether it's, it's through youth sports, whether it's through how we treat uh, workers, I, I just thought that there are just so many things where that really are just considered the norm. And so this really looks at, at ways of, of challenging those thoughts. Um, and you know, it's a good way, hopefully, for, for the future leaders in the industry to kind of help change that culture.